Dog. Oh. The time has come, SG34. We have made it to the end of season number nine and the beginning of the end with season 10 premiere, y'all. We've had quite a few things happen this season. We've had small gates, we've had big gates, we've had the galaxy in peril by a new threat to the Ori. Hallowed be the Ori! I'm excited to get into this one with you guys. So let's just dive right on in. A big old cheers to the gang. It's, it's go big or go home. It's go big or go home. The Knights of the Round Table. Merlin. Merlin. Not gonna lie, did not expect to see all this, uh, so you're in the you know, Arthurian. Yes, me carrying this child right now is a problem. Lure tied into SG One. Merlin was conducting research on some kind of new invention. We gotta go to it. Of destroying ascended beings. This well, I don't need new to place. It's got all the answers. The they just find like every like significantly hey, uh, you know technological uh, advancement they've ever needed. Possibly work. Well, technically, Merlin's research didn't refer to killing. A better translation would be neutralizing or canceling out. In other words, you have no idea what it might be. Yeah, pretty much that's it. <laughs> he said, "Ah, uh, you got me." Ah. Ah. Are we, are we actually in Camelot? No way. Um, Merlin doesn't escape you. It doesn't. Once you start it, it sticks with you forever. Well, it certainly looks like a place where Merlin might have lived. I wouldn't get too excited just yet. There could be dozens of villages in the area. Well, there's that. Excalibur? That you? Traveler. I am Eurek, governor of this village. Welcome to Camelot. Nice. This is Antonius, our village historian. Welcome to Camelot, past and future home of King Arthur. You know the history of the Battle of Camelot. Of course, where Arthur was mortally wounded by Mordred. Arthur, mortally wounded. It has not happened. Arthur defeated Mordred at the okay. Battle of Camelot. After which he and his fellow knights set off to find the Sangrao. But we know in our hearts that one day he will return to us. Um, what happened to, to Merlin when he left? Okay, they seem a little shook. Enjoy your stables. All right, clearly a touchy subject here. Merlin's name is rarely mentioned in public. Why is that? Many believe he was a wizard of darkness. The library where he practiced his strange arts remains sealed to this day. Merlin had a library here? Let's check it I'd out. Like to see that. I'm afraid that's impossible. The library is protected. All those who enter Merlin's sanctuary forfeit their lives to its guardian, the Black Knight. Worst case scenario, he's got another holographic knight protecting his goods like he did back in England. Either way, I don't see a big problem. Given your noble victory over the knight in the Avalon cave, it would seem that your overconfidence is ill-advised. Did I say anything about me doing the fighting? I think we should split up and look around. Good call, Sam. Yeah, that comment I made about uh, Sam and Teal definitely <coughs> doesn't hold in the later, in the later half of the series. Never! Yield? Is this Morgana? I yield. But next time, I want to be Arthur. <laughs> I don't know if that's going to help you keep moving around like Ed Grimley. Mine? Thank you. Try not to bob around quite so much. Nice. <laughs> Broomstick battles with my kid brother and the Sodan ritual of Kelshak Low made me the nimble warrior that I am today. <laughs> Man like Cam really came here to flex on these kids. So, like. <laughs> okay. you need one of you? Dora's magic. Magic. There is a key. No one dare use it. Where will we find this key? It is kept in the village archives. The lives would be forfeit the instant you stepped inside. We have faced one of Merlin's knights before. Antonius, you're the village historian. Don't tell me you haven't dreamt about what might be inside there. The dooby truth. 
No one must know of my participation in this venture. Got it. Not Murek, not my fellow villagers. Okay. This episode is also a great example of how uh, is, you know, future technology or so scientifically advanced is perceived as magic. Okay, this music is epic. What do we got? Yep, this could take a while. This is interesting. This is a, a reference to Merlin's prophetic abilities. There's a, a similar myth on Earth. It's not meant to be taken literally, but we have seen that a lot of legends and folklore have a, a strong basis. In fact, Avalon, Atlantis. The Easter Bunny. Well, I hate to break it to you folks, but the only technology I'm seeing is a bunch of dusty old books. No, Cam, not the, not the book in the... Oh, the book on the bookshelf turns into a, a hidden passageway trick. And a secret passage. We've tempted fate enough for one night. Well, you can stay up here if you want. No. I shall take my leave. He said, I'm not taking part of this. Good luck. Have fun. <laughs> okay, now this is starting to look a little bit more what we know. It's looking gouldy. It's lit. It's an ancient control device. What does it control? I have no idea. Okay, a bind with their dish now. Livia. Oh, this kind of reminds me of that Stargate, uh, Stargate Atlantis episode with the Jedi when they were in that hole, and then Shep was like piecing it together. Was that that episode, or is that mixing that with a, with a Cam episode? I think Cam did a similar thing too, didn't he? He's dead. Well, yeah, when the walls are collapsing, and the roof was collapsing with Teal. It was a similar episode too. Mirk, we're very sorry about what happened. You went into the wizard's library, didn't you? Yes, we did. Look, it wasn't supposed to go down like that. We figured if the knight was going to appear, it would be in the chamber, and he wouldn't go after anybody but us. You awakened the curse. Mm -hmm. Black Knight is not part of any curse. He isn't magical, and he isn't unbeatable. We learned that a long time ago, Merlin was working on a weapon that could be used against them, and the key to finding that weapon is inside that library. We gotta get in, sir. Never leave this village. Take the curse with you. Well, we can't just give up. Daniel, we're not exactly welcome here anymore. Don't you see this is exactly what Merlin wants? It's so funny. You can like visibly see and in his like agitated responses, Daniel does, does not give a fuck. Like as the seasons have gone by, he's be like, no, 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 but the culture, but Jack, we can't just do this now. Fuck it. <laughs> Catch him on a bad day, he'll just fucking light the place up and take what he wants. <laughs> just give me a little time to talk to these people. If I can get any <laughs> some of them on our side, we might be able to get Merrick to reconsider. Oh, grab Excalibur, you are the chosen one. Bing bada boom, let us in. It is said Arthur will not return from his quest until one among us succeeds in removing it. You ever try it? It is for the young men who are preparing to be knights to test themselves with the sword. It's my brother Ramus will do when he comes of age. Yeah, but I've seen you spar. I only do that to help Ramus train. When Arthur does come back, he will need knights to join him on his next crusade. Valencia, leave us. Yes, Governor. You abuse my tolerant nature, Colonel. I take it it didn't go so well. Not really. These men will escort you to the great ring. There is no magic involved. <laughs> oh no. Not like this. By the gods! Oh no, by the squad. SG-1, welcome aboard the Odyssey. Colonel, what's going on? We received a subspace transmission from a Jaffa vessel near P3Y-229. They were investigating some unusual energy readings. Ooh, there it is! Unfortunately, the Daedalus is still in the Pegasus galaxy, but the Korolev will be joining us as soon as possible. I didn't think it was operational yet. It's been rushed into service. 
or to meet up Expedited, with okay. Joker ships I'm not mad. By all indications, that space gate's operational. There's no telling when the Ori are gonna start sending ships through. Okay, uh, go, but leave, leave me us. behind. Leave us, yeah. Daniel, even if you're right, the villagers are never gonna let you back in the library. Then beam me in. Oh, true. Did not think of that. That's a good uh, little we'll sneak around. Chance. We'll have the Russians swing by and pick you up on the way through. You have until then. Thank you, sir. All right, I'm a fan of Emerson. But that game. Ooh. My guess is we can shut him down by inputting the correct code sequence on that control panel. Merlin's pen number? Colonel Emerson, I wish to be transferred to the Ministry of Our Control Vessel. Can I ask why? I intend to seek out some much needed allies. Rounding up the squad. Sorry, didn't mean to wake you. I was Kelno Reeming. Teal taught me the fundamentals. Did he mention you should remain conscious in the process? I've cross-referenced half a dozen passages that mention the Black Knight. Now, there's a series of recurring words and phrases that stand out if you know what you're looking for. What's the matter? Well, if I'm wrong about this, then... Now look, I'll take care of the Black Knight. I will pull the sword from the stone, just like last time. Well, I think we've been over this. This is a completely different scenario. Do we have a choice? Yeah. No. Odds are not in our favor here. It's a good thing or a bad thing. That bad. doesn't sound very good, yeah. You say I'll go. Make it work! Okay. Uh, okay. Oh boy. I mean, what do you do? That's almost as scary as a guy. That's actually the <sighs> Nope, didn't think so. That is intimidating as hell. Mitchell, how's it going out there? He's getting, he's getting tossed! Do something! Help him! He brought this on himself. Can our boy get it out the mud? Oh, oh she's going for it! What do you think you're doing? Let's go! Uh, yeah, uh. That, that is quite a lot of loot. Greetings, friend. I am Merlin. Yes, you are. Mitchell, I did it. Greetings. Black Knight gone. I am. Not exactly. <laughs> I already doing all the combinations I came up with. Mark the passage. All that is Mitchell. I guess this is like a light. It's, it's a, it kind of looks like a lightsaber. Ooh. All that is me. Mark the passage of all that is before you. Greetings, friend. Oh, sweet. <laughs> See what I mean? Like. <laughs> Exactly that happened. there's been no other signs of activity we've already attempted to destroy the gate no luck. our combined forces had no effect so all you had to do was shoot the control crystal pretty much i had to find the access code first if i hadn't none of this would have beamed in and i wouldn't have seen merlin's hologram message this pendant now in That's every depiction like. of merlin yeah. from his library I've seen it, and in fact, the hologram message was wearing it as well. The riddle mentions a pendulum. 
Now, at first I thought that was a reference to a, a passage of time, like a pendulum clock. Then I realized it was more literal, something that hangs. Did that seem a little small? Well, just remember, we're talking about things that transcend ordinary space-time here. Relative size has no meaning. This is Colonel Emerson of the Earth Vessel Odyssey. Yes, I know who you are. Yo! Everyone's coming together, Asgard's, the Jaffa, who are free. Well, we're not exactly sure. All of our ships. Here. Flying into our territory in an unmarked cargo ship. I didn't think you were that stupid. I have come to seek the assistance of the Lucian Alliance. I take it back. You are stupid. You're not stupid. You're insane. All right, he's asserting his strength. I should kill you where you stand. I have come seeking your assistance. The fate of the galley says at stake. That was cold as fuck. We that was so tight. The information <laughs> that Daniel Jackson was there was enough data for us to surmise what this so-called anti-ori weapon might be. Maybe it just drains its power supply. I was. It is an energy transfer device, similar to a zero-point module, oh. except that the energy is channeled into the dimension occupied by ascended beings. And this energy is harmful to them in some way. It is a form of interference. We would simply need to activate it and send it to the Ori galaxy, and they would be eliminated. Yeah, but how do we do that? We're talking about the supergate. We dial out before they can dial in. Precisely. How do we dial that? Dude, I can already hear the music, the close up of this massive freaking gate just spinning. Oh, what it's going to be so happy. Oh my gosh. What? Colonel Mitchell? Hi. Uh, come on in. It's all yours. You do not wish to claim a prize for defeating Merlin's champion? Well, there was one thing. Hide it in plain sight? Maybe you gave it to them? I could see that. It is the Sun Growl. This is the Sangra, also <laughs> known as the Bloodstone. Oh, that he said Sangria. Every movie I've seen, that's a cup. Uh, no, uh, the notion that the, the Grail was a cup or chalice, particularly the one used by Christ at the Last Supper, was a, a late addition to the myth. Mm, I found it among these trinkets. Arthur and his knights left to quest to the Sangra long ago. They journeyed to three distant lands mentioned in Merlin's prophecy. Castiana, Sahal, and Vagombre. Jackson, that's days, weeks to find the proper reference, and then there's no guarantee that we're going to be able to track yeah, it down. Yeah, we are on the clock Searching here. Thanks to Valencia, we have been given a sign that Arthur will return soon, and you True. are welcome to stay with us and wait in the Look, once and for all, there was no curse. Okay, this, this is a device. There is no magic. Boy, my timing's off today. Colonel Mitchell, Dr. Jackson, welcome hey. aboard the Coralette. He said, not only am I the negotiator, I'm fucking in this bitch. That's what he said. <laughs> wow. Colonel Carter. The Seer's already programmed a replacement crystal, so it's just a matter of somebody getting out there and installing it. And I suppose you'd like to volunteer. Yes, sir. Mitchell and Jackson didn't find the device. Sir, even without Merlin's device, dialing out is still our best bet because in the very least it will prevent them from dialing in. We don't know if that's how well, this gate works, actually. Power, we can maintain this connection indefinitely. You, know, you can't just have this portal open the whole time, you know? Did I just refer to a, the Stargate as a portal? Ugh. What's wrong with me? You know it's a goaded episode when they got the spacesuits. Are you ready, Colonel Carter? Ready as I'll ever be. I just thought of it. It'd be really cool to get like uh, see-through RGB I'm putting in our control crystal. RAM that looked like the uh, control crystals. We're picking up increased energy output coming from the gate. Carter, get off. It's an incoming wormhole. Get her out of there now. It's not working. This is bad. Sam. Look at the cloud! Look how massive that thing is! Oh my god. 
That is terrifying. Yeah, I'm surprised she did not get bodied. Truthfully, I thought she was gone. Look at all these ships. Sir? This is Colonel Chekhov. What is the situation? We've got an incoming wormhole. I suggest you prepare for battle. Well, yes, we're going to war. We are going to war. Oh my god! Oh my goodness! Dog, dog, these are massive. <laughs> she got courtside tickets <laughs> to the end of the universe. <laughs> We're receiving a message from one of the Ori ships. Text only. What does it say? Damn. And those who are prideful. Don't speak in riddles when it's about to go down. Open a channel. They said no VC. <laughs> Text only, please. They're powering up their weapons. Here we go. Guys, All batteries guys. Open fire. All right. We got some rail guns, we got some missiles. Any luck this is, this is. Look at... Guys, what is this hyper beam? <laughs> no! Are we losing this? Sir, we just lost sublight engines. Yo, what am I watching right now? Look at the size! This is not even comparable! These things are massive! We're not winning this! No shot! We're not winning this! We have to scramble the 302! Cam, Cam, holy smokes! It's no good, sir. We're dead in the water. Okay, okay. A little assistance. Oh, oh, they're really just cannon fodder, the good ships. Yo, we're not running this back. We had one ship go <laughs> and the crew. There's no way I see what gets this sadistic and just bodies more than half of the show. Shot. We should have went to origin. <laughs> Bruh, 